Hello, white charters, and welcome back to another exciting installment of White Charts 101, where we produce quick video tutorials that hopefully help enable you to make smarter investment decisions and produce more effective client communications. Today, I'm going to be your host. My name is Greg Cagley. I'm one of the customer success managers here at White Charts. My goal is to help make sure that each and every one of my clients get the most value they possibly can out of the platform. So today, I'm going to be talking about meeting prep, those quarterly and annual review meetings that you have with your clients. Uh, oftentimes looked at as being tedious and uh, a lot of work to put information together. With just a few clicks in Y charts, we can make that preparation a lot more streamlined and much more efficient. So um, I'm going to be covering this in just a couple minutes, and I'm going to mostly be talking about the different kinds of documents, handouts, visualizations, things like that that you can produce that are more client facing for your meeting purposes. So to start with, I want to highlight the fact that when you're in the quote page for a portfolio in model portfolios, here in the upper right hand corner, there is a reports button. This reports button is where you will go to produce any of our pre-made PDF reports. Um, these are really great for highlighting performance, allocation, exposure information, um, risk information, uh, summarizing top holdings, things like that. So when I click on the reports button there, it's going to produce a little menu where I have a few different types of reports I can generate. Uh, it defaults to the comparison report section. So this is where you can go to produce something like a side-by-side -side report here. I might come down to the side-by-side -side comprehensive report you know, benchmark. Um, this is really great for comparing one portfolio versus another. So this can be for an existing client of yours where maybe you're talking with them about making some changes to their portfolio. You could take portfolio A versus portfolio B and on the same report, visualize how those two portfolios are different. So you can really hone in on those changes that you're talking with them about. Another use case for this would be working with a prospect client. So if they provided their outside holdings ahead of time, you can upload those holdings to model portfolios and then compare that with one of your already established models, or maybe you've created an ad hoc portfolio themselves or for them. So um, that's the side-by-side -side reports. And then in the other category here, the overview reports, these are the ones that you're likely going to be wanting to generate if your objective is really just to review a client's portfolio with them. Um, the comprehensive overview itself is going to be 13, 15 pages, all the nitty gritty details you could possibly want to share with them about their portfolio, performance, allocation, uh, risk, um, top holdings, all sorts of things like that. The two page overview is a much more pared down version as the name suggests. It's about a page and a half usually. Um, basic performance information, high level allocation information, and top holdings, that's about it. So that's especially useful for your clients that are maybe less savvy in the uh, financial space, but um, you still want to be able to communicate all the necessary information that gives them a clear picture of what their portfolio looks like. So beyond the reports themselves, um, once you click on one of those and generate them, another option for a, a different kind of visualization that you can absolutely produce very quickly is uh, the good old fashioned chart. So if I go into the fundamental chart tab here in my uh, portfolio's quote page, it's going to default to a chart that shows the performance of the portfolio versus the benchmark I, that I had selected. So this right here is a quick thing. You could swivel your monitor around and show that to your client. Um, if you wanted to print that off, you absolutely could. You could come up here to export and go to print and actually create a handout for them. Um, something to keep in mind with fundamental chart, it's really easy to kind of toggle a couple different settings to get different types of charts in front of your client. So Again, by default, this looks at performance over time, one year it looks like, but with a couple of toggles of these radio buttons over here on the left under the data format section, I can change that to a growth of 10K chart. So I can see what $10,000 a year ago would have turned into today, or I can click this bottom option, which might be hidden by my screenshot here a little bit, but uh, bottom option is the percent off high chart, otherwise known as a drawdown chart. So this is a really effective for especially looking year to date um, with something like the coronavirus crisis going on. You can see that market dip um, and then you can compare the portfolio versus the benchmark, whether your portfolio dipped from its high more than the benchmark, so on and so forth. So that's it with a few quick reports and a couple of visualizations with charts. You're well on your way to having an effective client meeting.